Hey y'all, Rochelle here, your delightful crafter. Uh, got one more video I'm pre-recording for you guys while I'm on vacay with the hubby. Uh, this is another Tonic Studios order to share with you guys. It is a single bundle. And, um, but this one I was so excited about because a lot of you know how much I absolutely adore their My Memory book line. And, um, these are so cute. That's all I can say. So, stick around. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you stick around a spell. If you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. Ding that bell next door if you want to get notifications of my future videos. Thumbs up, likes, always appreciated. And any questions or comments, please leave them down below. So, the first interesting thing about this bundle is it actually includes pattern paper, y'all. That almost never happens with Tonic. This is called Dolly Art, D-A-L-I. It says there's 18 sheets of 200 GSM cards. They're calling it cardstock. I'm going to call it pattern paper because to me, cardstock needs to be at least, I prefer 200 or 300. So I'm going to call this heavyweight pattern paper. These aren't normally, some of this I absolutely love, some of it's eh. So we've got this kind of like this dress, distressed collage like pattern paper here. Um, as you can see, there's bees, and that is the theme of this bundle. We've got different tags, if you want to cut out the different tags. Now, I don't kind of like, I don't really like how they're doing that. That, that I'm not a big fan. I think that should be totally separate from that side. We have some bees and honeycomb. Oh, let's see the other side. With some beautiful flowers and some more bees. We have a, a distressed script page. Um, they have these as postcards that you can cut out, but they're not even, they're not at like an even cut. It's kind of odd, but I do like that because y'all know why I love anything postal. Some beautiful roses, some more. Got this one. This is gorgeous. I am in love with this one. That is just stunning. Then, I can't read in that. Maybe some of y'all can, but I can't. It's, very, it's a very distressed paper collection. Very muted colors, which I'm okay with. Gorgeous. And, okay, so now, and now it's repeating. So it looks like two of everything. So there's that. I'm not going to go through any the papers again. So there are the papers. This particular bundle is called the Hopes in Hexagons Full Bundle. And again, this is part of the My Memory Book line. Now, with my discount, this was $90. Um, but there's a lot in this collection. I guess we'll start with the big. So the largest die, let me see. Okay, this is going to need a large format die machine. If you're new to crafting, uh, we, the standard die machines are your regular big shot, your, uh, Spellbinders Platinum Six. Uh, if you can still have, if you still have a cuddle bug, um, the Gemini Junior. They're they're all basically like almost six and a quarter inch um, dies, uh, and this is six point seven by seven and three quarter inches. So this isn't going to fit through your standard machine, but it's a hexagon memory book. And there are 25 dies in this one. And so we have sentiments that says love and laughter, 
hopes and dreams and then I can't read these small ones there but so there's that but this is the part that I went goo goo over when my sister sees it there's my iPad uh, no it's not cracked it looks like it it's the it's the gorilla glass that's on top of it that is cracked and I happened to drop two of the dies sets that are also included okay look at look y'all bees and honeycombs I fell in love with that look at that B E beautiful memories eight dies largest die is 4.8 by seven and a half inches so obviously you can use them um, if you want to try and create your own bases without um, your die machines you can possibly try that but this is one two three four five six seven I see seven dies okay one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, okay. That's cute. It even looks like the little trail with the bee um, flying around. So there's that. Then um, you also have, they have a new, uh, they're, they call them the Staggered Leaves Simple Spine Die Set. And it, so it's a new spine system and way the, the, so the way you make this particular mini album is it opens like a folio and the pages fold in on top of themselves kind of like you know you're shuffling cards they they fall into themselves so they stagger on top of each other so you have a spine system on both sides so that's nice and so you can do different sizes it is so it's the largest oh. The largest die is three and a three and three quarter inches by eight point one inches. So there's that. And then the last one is a sentiment die set to use with it. Six dies. It says beautiful moments tag sentiment dies. And one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So you have your tag bases and then you have some decorative ones here and it says beautiful moments to treasure and from my heart, oh, a gift from my heart to yours. So, so you can even use these to make um, <clears throat> gift tags for Christmas. And that's it. This is a pretty short and simple, sweet uh, video that I'm sharing. Uh, hopefully I will have some more goodies to share with y'all when I come back. I do have a new, I'm just going to share it because it's just the one, a new house mouse that just arrived. This is one that I've been watching for a while as well. And um, this one is called, this is a millennium, a millennium collectible February 2000. And this is called Ace of Hearts. And they're sitting there playing cards. And look, cheating. Monica, <laughs> she just chewed out the little heart from the Ace of Hearts to give to her little friend. And then that's, look, Muzzy and Mud Pie. That's probably Amanda over here. Muzzy and Mud Pie are always, they're the boys. They're always getting in trouble. And they're, they're looking at her cards. <laughs> and this one was pretty dirty. It was, it was really dirty. And so it looks wet because I did use the, the, um, the ultra clean, the, my favorite things, ultra clean. And I cleaned it off and then it, it was in good condition, but I went ahead and left some on. You can kind of see it looks a little wet, but I left it on on purpose, uh, because this is a, this is 1999. So this is 22 years old, coming up on 23 years old. And so I didn't, I thought it would be, you know, good to let a little conditioning on the rubber. So yeah, so 
that's it, y'all. That is, that's all I have to share for now. Um, I know I will have more to share with you guys when I get back. Um, again, we are supposed to get back Saturday. So it will probably be Sunday the 7th. Is it the 7th? Let me look. Hold on. Pull up the calendar. Yeah. So it'll probably be November the 7th before you guys see another anything from me. Uh, any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below or shoot me an email, which is in the description. I will try to get back to people once I return um, because we have limited contact while we're away. We are vacationing on a cruise ship somewhere in the Gulf of Mexico. So long overdue. I'm so excited. We leave tomorrow. Whoop, whoop. All right. Um, love you guys to pieces. Again, questions or comments, leave them down below. I'll get back to you. And as always, happy crafting. Bye-bye.